Hey guys, here are Marta Geek. In this video, I want to share with you guys a very cool tip here. If you are a Chrome user, uh, like you see here, I have a floating YouTube player. This is playing from YouTube, like you see there. And from here, I can have access to the volume if I want. I can also have access to the video settings if I want, like you see there. Um, I can also tap here and go to YouTube, kind of here for full screen. Or I could go ahead and cast the video on my TV. Um, over here, of course, I could go ahead and move the video around. I can also resize it as well. Like you see there, I can also resize it as well. And uh, very cool. Like you see there, that is a very cool tip. So let's go ahead and show you guys um, how to get it done. Uh, first of all, we're going to need the Google Chrome browser. That's why I'm doing this because this is the Google Chrome browser. Um, when you go to the Chrome Web Store, like see a Chrome Web Store, uh, make sure you search for floating YouTube. When you search for floating YouTube, you're going to have this in apps, floating YouTube in apps, and you're going to have an extension called floating YouTube extension. Uh, make sure you install both. When you click here, uh, right here, there's going to be an option to install or to add to Chrome. Make sure you do that there and make sure you launch this one as well. This one, the second extension, what's going to do is going to give you this option right here. Like you see here in the URL box, uh, you're going to see when you're on a YouTube video, you're going to see this red box or this red icon right there. So that's why you need the floating YouTube extension. So once you have that done, um, let's say, for example, you want to launch a video using the app alone. This is the app alone. Uh, this is my new tab right here. Uh, right here, like you see there, I'm going to have the option to cop to paste a link of a video. Let's go ahead right there, paste the video. Uh, that's if you already have copied the link of a video. And like you see there, I can see a video without even opening the YouTube page, like you see there. But let's go ahead and click right there. The easiest way is using the extension way. And the great thing here is that, for example, you won't see the icon button if you're on another website, like you see there. There's nothing right there. Um, even on YouTube, if you go, if you're navigating through YouTube, you're not going to see nothing there. You see, you don't see nothing there unless you click on a video. Let's go and click on this video. And there you go. Now you got that red icon right there. So let's go ahead and tap it. When you tap it, Voila, now you got a floating YouTube player. Very, very awesome, like you see there. Uh, and that's very convenient. I can see myself using this a lot. Really, really liked it. And I think it's very, very cool. Let's go and mute the video there. Uh, you can also resize it, like I said. Uh, you could do everything you could do on YouTube. You could do it here on the floating video. Uh, you can make it very small if you want. Shoops. Look at that. <laughs> And you go ahead and put it in the corner. And if you are a Safari user or any other browser, you could go ahead and keep on using your browser and having the YouTube player right there. That's very, very cool. And that's it, guys. Just wanted to share this little tip here for the floating YouTube player on using your Chrome browser very very awesome so thanks for watching the video guys let me know if you like videos like these tips from google chrome and maybe in the future i'll keep doing a couple google chrome web browser tips videos as well thanks for watching guys till next time